Hey Aries, welcome back to my channel. This is for Aries Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus Placement. It is a timeless love reading. It will not always resonate for completely resonate for each and every one of you. So do take what resonates and then always head over and watch your Rising Moon and Venus sign readings for additional clarity. I am doing that um, giveaway for December again. I already reached out to the person who won the $100 gift card for November. This will be four free readings um, and it will be 50, 10 to 15 minutes long. You can choose love, general messages or messages from spirit. Um, new viewers, cross watchers, all you need to do is be a subscriber. So go ahead and hit that button. Returning and new subscribers, leave a gift or a present emoji in the comment section of every reading that you view during um, the month of December that is my reading. Each time you do I will add you to a list of names and then at the end of December I will pick four people. Do make sure your notifications are on for YouTube. Um, that way if you're one of the four people that I've been randomly picked you get my message and I can get that reading out to you as quickly as possible. Forbidden love. Sorry guys. Forbidden love. Rejected love. That could be in the same situation. I'm getting like a co-worker or business type, excuse me, business type um, relationship where it might have been frowned upon to mix personal life with business. guys perfect timing take action now so something is going to happen from the time that you view this package deal all or nothing keeping hope alive keeping that faith I feel like somebody is returning you might have changed places of employment for that and it also may be that you might have met someone that might have possibly or you might have been dating someone else and came in contact with someone and ended it because you already had other people but you never stopped thinking about one another something like that digging deeper there's more to be learned I'm going to pull actual names and a card of timing characteristics so do stay till the end adjudication you might be illegally separating from someone whether you are married and need to separate and divide um, divide properties possessions it might be that you need to get your name off of a lease or something if you were living together mature man for those of you dealing with an older man very business like looks like he's getting gray hair and then official person somebody that might have like worn fought for our country has medals wore a uniform maybe went to war but in the service. We have two men here, so for those of you that are looking for the masculine energy, you might already be in a relationship and there's somebody coming towards you. It could be someone that rejected you. For those of you that are involved with the same sex, that also could resonate. All right, let's get characteristics. All right. Glasses could be reading glasses or they need glasses all the time. Younger than you. Medium skin. 
dark hair, dark eyes, fair skin. For those of you, you could have met someone in the summer or you will be meeting someone in the summer. Facial skin, facial hair, facial skin, facial hair. I know, I hear that noise too, baby. My dog's ears just went up. I know, I hear it. Olive skin. It's okay. You're in Kona's house. Fine lines. I love a bald head. And then winter. So for some of you, it will be happening in the winter in the summer, but I'm also going to pull an exact card of timing after I get through the reading. Oh, two wanted to come out. Let's see what they are. Ten of Pentacles and the Wheel of Fortune. This could be somebody that comes from money that you're about to meet. It is divinely guided. This person might be somebody that you know through your family. This could be somebody that you worked with, with it being the Ten of Pentacles. They could have their own business and be very well off. Your energy, the Nine of Cups. So with this being your energy, you may have water in your chart areas, but this is also you feeling like you already have everything you need. Like I said, you might find yourself in a relationship right now or dating someone. It's like you're pretty content. You're sitting on a bunch of presents. You got those nine of cups behind you. It's like you're already feeling great about what you have. A water sign could be coming towards you. Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. They're emotionally stable and they're looking for love. They're ready for commitment. And I do feel it possibly could be somebody that is thinking of you right now, wishing that they hadn't rejected you current situation they're watching you Aries I feel like you might receive a direct message or an email but they're keeping an eye on you and you possibly may visit their social media often too the mutual energy between the two of you there was a fight possibly rejection but there was a fight there was someone who walked away with hurt feelings and spirit is saying to guard yourself. It's also the fact that if you protect your heart so much, there could be something right in front of you that is meant for you and you may not see it because you have that blindfold off. So do protect your heart always. But put your guard down a little bit. Be ready for what's coming towards you. I feel like this person has their heart open for you. And the overall outcome, the King of Pentacles. So this play, remember the Ten of Pentacles came out. So this person, like I said, could ha come from money. Um, they could have ha just recently received an inheritance. They could have their own business. Very high up in their chain of command within their employment. Or their career. Being being available like they can offer you long term. All right, let's see. All right, clarifying the nine of cups. Yes, yeah, see. There is something coming towards you that you are unaware of. You already feel like you've got it all, but there is a brand new beginning coming your way. 
and it's going to be successful. It's going to be everything you thought it could, like, I feel like you walked away from somebody because of rejection. You may have rejected them. But I feel like what is coming towards you is about to be so much better than you ever anticipated it being. Especially if you date it, if you met someone and you're already dating someone. Or it's like somebody else might have, you might have met someone and they were married and this needed to end. Or within work. And you couldn't have that work type personal relationship meshing. I think something great is about to happen. Yeah, this person feels like the wounded warrior. They possibly could have fire and water in their chart. But they want to offer you love. Yeah, see, the devil... I feel like there was somebody who tried to have their cake and eat it too. Like was already in a relationship and tried to have a relationship with you. Was only thinking of themselves at one point. And you may be the one that walked away from them because of the way they treated you. But with this five of swords and this five of swords energy in the current situation and the three of wands, it has left this person looking out onto their future. And it possibly there could have been an ending or whatever was going on on the sidelines. It's like looking out onto their future, thinking like, I see Aries in my life. Why did I, you know, but it wasn't the right timing. Sometimes people meet. So that other things could happen down the road. Maybe meet and feel what love could really feel like. And see that the person that they might have been with. Where negative feelings, where negative energy was existing. It was a triggering energy for them to end that. To heal from that and come towards you. Alright. Clarifying the two of swords spirit. You have no idea how good it's about to get. This person held out hope that you would forgive the way they react, they, the way they treated you. I really feel like for some of you, it is around coworker or business, and there was just that connection could not evolve into a personal connection at the time. They've slowly been making their way towards you, and there will be an apology. I feel like little do you know they see long term with you. The Empress, they only have eyes for you, Aries. Also could be dealing with a Libra. When the two of you connected, there was so much happiness between the two of you. Like it's when you think of your best times in love, it's with this person. But they had a lot on their plate. They had, they had other offers. They had other decisions to make. It's like now they want to come towards you and make you the priority. Yeah, they found themselves at a crossroads. And they may not have told you the whole story about what was going on. This very well could be your energy, Aries. Do take it how it resonates. You may not have told everybody, someone the entire story. You might have been in a connection. You know, and just didn't tell them. 
I know if it lied within you, you felt like this person was your wish fulfillment, but you just had other things going on that you couldn't offer them a commitment. And like I said, if that's their energy, you know, take it as it resonates. All right, messages between Aries and their person. I'm almost done, baby. See, it was not the right time. I feel a connection to you like no other. I can't admit my feelings for you right now. See, I'm telling you, there was either another connection going on, there were other people involved, or this was a work-related. I don't know what I want. I always remember you. And you make me want to be a better person. So I feel like it was very triggering that they met you for them. Sorry, guys, I had to pause the video. I do. I see either them in a connection where they weren't happy, but they had to deal with that. Somebody might have been married. I've been so grounded all my life, it's hard for me to trust the spiritual elements of our connection, yet I can't deny they exist. Your spirit is sending them synchronicities. I feel like you're both receiving synchronicities. There's a reason the two of you met when you did. I want to know everything about you, but I hold myself back from asking. I'm afraid I'll get in too deep. I close my eyes and imagine you're here with me. It feels so real. I'm beginning to understand this is what it means to be in the 5D. I just got goosebumps, guys. This person, you, you both might have had other connections, but you both knew there was something between the two of you. In April, and not likely. So with not likely, if this just happened within a couple days or a couple weeks, it's not likely that it's going to come around this quick, that these many changes are going to happen this quickly but like I said more than a year from now there is the energy of slowly moving towards one another but if it is forbidden love if there was other connections going on you got to you got to make sure you take them care of those connections in the right manner or that will be karma that needs to be paid back Sarah and Carl, Neil, Will or William, Emily, Brian, Andrea, Christian, I feel like my neighbors are hanging decorations and lights. And they're making my dogs bark. Margaret, Maggie, Andrew, Chloe, Gavin, Brian, I or Y, Abigail or Abby, Kim, Haley, could also be Kimberly, Samuel, Sam, Helen, Olivia, Adam, Eli, Harvey, Noah, Judith, Jameson, and Thor. All right. Now, guys, I will have you know that I went to, e my boyfriend went to every country, like on Google, and found the most popular names. So, there are going to be ones that seem different, but I try, I just try to include everyone. And then somebody else wrote to me, oh, Frank came out. But in front, like, I'm from France, but it came out, you know, so it might, your person's name might come out in English, 
but where you're from, it may be something different. You know what I mean? Alice or Allie and Billy or William, Bill. Oh, here, as I said, Allie and Hassan came out. Robin, Benny, Zaki. See, I told you he went to different countries. And Reza, Maya, Mia, Axel, Atlas, Elliot, Jude, Junior, and we, Judy, and Bruce. All right, guys. Like I said, there's so many names out there in the world that I definitely am not going to even make a dent in all of them. But other people have wrote to me and said that they would rather have... Um, that they would rather have the Scrabble tiles. So let me know what you'd rather have. Do you want Do you want me to switch it up? I'm just trying to keep it fun and new for everyone. So I'm just trying to think of different things that I can add. And I wish you the best in this connection. And I will be back for many more readings. Stay safe.